We're here with Senator Bob Smith from his home in Sarasota, Florida. And Senator, I understand uh, the decision is uh, going to be made shortly by you about something very interesting. Well, I'm, I'm thinking, uh, Doug, about uh, running for the United States Senate here in Florida. It's a big decision. Uh, it's going to involve, uh, you know, a lot of money, of course, and a lot of support. And uh, I'm testing the waters a little bit, so to speak, to see. I, I think what I would say is, is that this country right now, where we're headed with the huge debt uh, and the, uh, the, the growth of government, uh, you know, by the day, by the hour, the debt, we're saddling our children with this in the future. This is not really what America is all about. It's not the constitutional republic that we formed. And I believe that not only is it important for Republicans to get back to the basics, but, it, but it, for Americans. Uh, it's bigger than the Republican Party, but I think the Republican Party may be the only hope for America right now. You know, I, I, I have to say, uh, it's not a bad thing for Republicans to start acting like Republicans again. You know, for the last eight years we were in, you know, we had our share of scandals, we ran the debt up, uh, the deficits, and uh, we basically compromised our principles uh, many, uh, too often. Too often we did that. So I, I would run, I think, as a, as a person, let's bring the party back to basics. The, the conservative, Republican, uh, moral party uh, that we've always been, the party of Ronald Reagan. I believe that the, the optimism, the optimism, the hope for the future, and I think that's what our party should be. Now, as Bob Smith, as a, as a former senator and congressman from the state of New Hampshire, you know, I've had that time. I, I can find the bathroom. You know, I've been there uh, for 18 years uh, as a member of Congress and the Senate. I led on the issues that the Republican Party stands for the right to life, the Second Amendment, balanced budget, smaller government, uh, reduce the debt and the deficits, uh, strong immigration policies. We need a leader. Uh, the party needs a leadership and, and, and the courage to stand up for those principles. Uh, bipartisanship, you know, if it means that we have to go where the Democrats go, that's not, that's not good. That's not bipartisanship. You fight for what you believe in. And if you lose, you lose. But fight, stand up for what you believe in. I believe that's important, not only for our party, but for America. So if I run, that's, that's the reason uh, that I'm running. How can people get hold of you if they're interested in helping out? Well, I have, uh, I, uh, you can reach me on my private email, uh, Senator Bob Smith at Comcast.net. That's S-E-N-A-T-O-R, Bob Smith at Comcast.net. I'd love to hear from you, to let, let, to hear what you think. Uh, about my candidacy. If, if I do run and I were to win, we would make history right here in Florida because no senator, to the best of my knowledge, has ever been a senator from one state and then moved to another state and got elected to the U.S. Senate from that new state. So we would make history together, but more importantly, we would restore the values of our party. I want to talk to you one-on-one -on -one all over this state and here, let me hear from you. How can we bring our party back to the principles that, that founded it? The party of Abraham Lincoln, uh, the party of Ronald Reagan, uh, you know, the party that really we believe in uh, as conservatives and uh, not the party of those who uh, compromise and go over to the Democrat side. As I said, you know, bipartisanship, if it means going over to the Democrat side, that's not bipartisanship. So, uh, we do what's best for the country, but I believe what's best for the country are the true Republican values that we all believe in and stand for. So I'm, I would say to anybody out there listening, I would love to hear from you. Senator Bob Smith at Comcast.net. That's my personal email. I'll get it and I will respond to you. Do you think I should run or not? And are you prepared to lead with me to bring the party back to the basics uh, and uh, and, and that, that, I think, is good not only for our party, but for our country. And again, I would close by saying it's not bad for Republicans to start acting like Republicans. And that's the leadership that I would bring. And I've demonstrated that leadership for 18 years. So I can bring that kind of experience and that kind of knowledge on missile defense and on, on all of the budget issues. I've been there, done that. I know the issues. You don't, there's no time for me to have to get up to speed on anything. I can hit the ground running on behalf of the people of Florida. And I would just also say that, you know, I chaired the Ethics Committee in the Senate. I chaired the Environment and Public Works Committee in the Senate. I chaired the Strategic Forces Subcommittee in the Senate. That's part of the Armed Services Committee. They dealt with missile defense, very important issue now uh, in, in, in this uh, 
in this day and age with the, all the possibility of weapons of mass destruction getting on the, on missile heads and God knows going where uh, throughout the world. So I bring that, that's what I bring to the table and I, I hope that the, the people of Florida will take a good look at my, at my candidacy should I decide to run but honestly I'm in the decision making mode right now and I'd like to hear from you. If you think I should based on what I've told you or you would like to hear more I'd love to hear from you and hopefully I'll make a decision within the next probably next month, next 30 days. And Senator will also be doing updates periodically here on YouTube on yes, sir, issues sure. of importance. We'll try to do that, yes sir. Great, Senator, good luck. We'll talk to you soon. Thank you.